Though it's almost always the answer to some ill-formed analysis, poetry is truly about as sexy as flaccid paralysis. It's making me sick. Positively tragic that when I get enthusiastic about forceful rhythms, people look at me weird when I only mean iambic. It's depressing that these differing disciplines have now merged and twinned into a dizzying, dismal spin. Because I don't want to pen prose about heads and toes. I'm not interested in the scratch and sniff, of slapping skin, of getting beneath each other's packaging. To me, that's the opposite of fantasizing. I prefer daydreaming and fantasizing about you. And how we met, you remember, it was the last train out the station on the last night of November, a midnight carriage, and you needed a pen. I've been chewing it while staring, and as I passed it, we touched me, apologizing again and again, because right there, right there, no critic can interpret that first moment that we flirted or how the butterflies are inserted. And later, later there'd be no subtext to the way you undressed. You can't have how we bedded, picked apart by some foreign academic, so no, sex is not a poem. Forget intonation or personification, it's a formless mess of gratification. Infatuation leads to fornication and insemination. There's none of the beauty or extravaganza of a stanza, it's mostly just trying to work out where your hands are. <laughs> so it's titillation, not alliteration. Enjoying the moment without enjambement, because that's what a bed is for, not to be used as some silly sexual metaphor. Today it seems a sin to be without a sexual simile, so no, sex is not a poem. Neither is it a villanelle or a haiku. It can be a quiet afternoon or a typhoon or a sonnet that reaches its 14 lines a little too soon. It happens to all poems, you would think. <laughs> <laughs> but bad sex, bad sex is a good poem because it's easy to understand and often underhand, but good sex, good sex is a bad poem because it's wordless with references that only two people can truly understand. Cheers. Thank you. Mm -hmm.